Since the beginning of 2016, Spotify has established themselves as more than a musicing service, they are also music content. From Traffic Jams, Rap Caviar, Mogul and Now I'm With Band, the leader in musicking is leading the way into the future. I'm With Band takes six artists from Syria, Sudan, Somalia, Libya, Yemen and Iran and pairs them with six musicians from the USA to show unity through music. These brave artists travel to Toronto where they meet their counterparts. The journey of the trip, studio sessions and more are filmed in the new documentary short. I'm with the band artists it can't be easy to leave family and friends to pursue a dream thousands of miles away but these six souls did it and created some great music. Here are the six as follows. Kazra V. DJ and record producer from Iran, who specializes in techno and deep house, MOH flow singer-songwriter from Syria who has a brother A, and together the co-produce, Waya Hikasab A Somali musical group, Methil from Yemeni is a singer and songwriter who plays numerous instruments, SUFYVN and that complete producer and beatmaker loves to blend electronic, hip-hop and traditional Sudanese music. Ahmed Fakroun singer and songwriter, who plays many instruments hails from Libya and is known for pioneering modern Arabic music. The American artists were, designer, Pusha T, ex-ambassadors, K. Flay, Dr. Lonnie Smith, and BJ the Chicago Kid. Together they collaborated on six songs which are included and featured on the I'm With A Band playlist Kazra V and K. Flay. Did Justify You, MOH Flow and Pusha T wrote options, and in an unexpected collab, Waya Hakusub did a song with designer called Durbani Kari Tuma. Methil from Yemen worked with ex-ambassadors and created Cycles, SUFYVN and Chicago-based singer BJ the Chicago Kid made Thinking About You Sleepless in Cairo, and lastly, the very talented Ahmed Fakroon from Libya co-created Salam with Dr. Lonnie Smith. The importance of the I'm with a band playlist we are living in a current climate of hate, rhetoric and absolute ridiculousness. Trump video has been proposing a ban on certain countries that he and his people deem dangerous. This ban hasn't seen the light of day because those with a brain in the government understand that any ban based on religious beliefs is unlawful and will not be tolerated. As I sat there listening to the stories of these artists and everything they had to overcome just to get to North America to sing, rap and dance, then to them on stage was inspiring and I recommend everyone see this documentary short. The documentary short is available to now, and all songs are also available for your listening pleasure on Spotify.